even in our death you only feel shame? You're one of them now. No. Father, I came to say goodbye. I watched you die. You were there when we were shot? I pulled the trigger myself. You killed your own sons? You were both dead to me the moment you sided with the vampires. I only thank God that your mother isn't alive to see the disgrace you've become. I haven't turned yet. I don't want to. I'm going to let myself die, Father. Please. Yes, you are. Oh, I didn't mean to. Right, get away from me. Oh, let me help you, please. I need to hear them. Come upstairs. We can talk about it more, and, and we'll keep talking as long as you need. You're so sure I'm ready? And when you feel the same way, I'll be upstairs. Find anything yet? No, I looked everywhere. The place is, the place is clean. Well, I found this behind the blood in the fridge. Oh man, this is real dead end. Wouldn't beat myself up over it, man. What did you think you were gonna find, huh? An Isabel with cigar and slippers. <laughs> oh man, I, I, I gotta stop this. I can't, I can't keep searching for her. Really? After only two years? That's actually moderately healthy. <laughs> yeah, what are you going on? 146? I figured 200 marks probably a good stopping point. <laughs> uh, I mean, no answer is enough. I keep thinking I want to know why, when, you know, the precise moment when my wife decided life with me wasn't enough. <sighs> she charmed me, your wife, Isabel. She talked a good game, man. She was smart. She had this excitement in her eyes. I probably should have known there was something different about her. Some tidy Catherine. There had to be some reason I didn't kill her. That's enough, Damon. I don't want to hear anymore. I, you know, I just don't want to waste any more of my life searching for answers that I really don't want. I'm through with this, about I'm done with all of this. <laughs> 